Hello again, I'm still making filters and this is for 2015. So the biggest change I made is to, on this smallest unit, it's, it, it I think is going to be one of my better ones because of this type of holder, this plastic pan it's made in. This is made stronger than the last one I made and this one, the top comes off. All the P-Rock goes in here mm -hmm. and then it recovers and this shows it that the P-Rock is all installed in this one. This is ready to go in the, in the lake. This is that extra filter on top and this here now holds three, uh, it holds one gallon and one quart of P-Rock. And that brings the weight up to about uh, 12 to 13 pounds. So it'll stay put when you put it down on the lake bottom. And this okay. is this added filter that I put on the top. And these lock in place like this. I also add a screw here in, on, the, on these uh, latches so that the rough water or something won't wash it away. I think I've lost just one cover on this bigger one, but uh, this one, you don't probably have to use the screws in there if it's not that rough water. But I, and then it, these rubber bands I put on here, these hold that other filter in place. So that's what's good. One easy thing about it is it's so easy to clean. You take the first thing is you can, it's a good idea to put a union on this end here. And this would just, you glue that in place and then just take this union apart. You, they would have to glue, the, glue that themselves or do you glue that? No, I leave it so you can glue it in place because uh, to pack it in the box takes more room. But you can uh, glue this union in place and this comes apart. What kind of glue? Uh, it's a PVC uh, plastic, could you just plastic use, pipe. Could you just use super glue? Uh, I, I would use the PVC uh, uh, for okay. uh, PVC pipe. Okay. And uh, you can get that at Menards or, yeah, or at that's the Home Depot or. It's part, good to have it break apart here because on the union here, because this could hook up. This would be your foot valve and this would be your line going to your pump. And so you could just take it there and you can take this out and then you just take this cover off and dump this into a pail or something. And all of this will come apart too. You can slide this out. This comes out like this and you can take this plate off too. This is all, I made these out of a plastic also so uh, just two screws and you can take that out and you can clean it inside too mm -hmm. so I just put her back in here it's a pretty tight fit but it'll go and that stays in there and then you put your P-Rock if you wash it out or or keep a lot some extra on hand that's clean and uh, put that in so how many gallons per minute are these? This is 15 gallons a minute. That has all three quarter inch size. So that way you can take this off and handle it and leave this alone. You won't lose the charge on your, on your uh, prime on your pump and just put this back on again. I don't furnish the union. You have to buy that and the foot valve yourself. Which parts are those now? Can you point to those? This is the union and this is the check valve. And you can buy that at Walmart or Yeah, that's Depot? usually available at Menards or Walmart or, or any place. These would probably be wise to glue up and then place onto there. And uh, you can use, these come out with this and uh, you can either uh, glue a fitting if you got one with threading in. So everything you supply is 
is not this, this is about it right like there this. okay so the, the the other part there that you do not supply that no that but that's... usually people will have that with their pump right right and and this is set up for three quarter inch yeah and uh, now this is the same idea only it's twice the size or more and this was at 30 gallons per minute then and this will do 30 gallons a minute this will hold about three, a little over three gallons of pea rock, and it'll weigh out to about 30 pounds. So it's pretty solid when you put it down on the bottom. And uh, this uh, has the same setup. The water all comes in through the top, through here, and then it goes out. This is, goes to your pump and this is this is set up right now for a one inch pipe but you can take this apart here this would be held in with screws and you can go up to a two inch pipe size all the way or uh, if you've got uh, a different size you can change get different fittings to bring it down to whatever you want it, I make it with a one inch adapter for one inch pipe the way it's made Mm -hmm. So uh, okay, that's that's the same about the same thing. All right. And then uh, the only other thing that I can say is is uh, you use the quarter inch what I call quarter inch pea rock. If there is some sand mixed with it, you can take make yourself a. This is the eighth inch screen cloth. And uh, I would take and, and siphon out the fine stuff, wash it off, and, and so you get rid of the real fine sands. So everything you got that's above is eight inch or bigger. Okay. That uh, it helps clean it out, but okay. that's only one time you have to do that when you got new pea rock. And okay. maybe a lot of places carry pea rock that's clean, so there's no sand in it too. Okay. Okay. So that All right. looks like uh, our best. I think it's going to be, I've made a, quite a few different types, but these I think are the best. And they're mm -hmm. going to be the easiest to take care of and should last forever, I'm honest. Okay. Yeah, thank you. All right, thank you.